Hello and welcome to CGD Games. My name's Lee, aka CGD, and today we're checking out a little bit of uh, House Flipper, uh, something that I've not really delved an awful lot into. Uh, I have tried it once a while back when it first arrived on uh, Xbox Game Pass, and I was either tired or I don't know, but I didn't really stick with it for a while, so I thought we'll check it out on the channel. Is it a simulator? I don't know, maybe we're stretching it a little bit again, but we'll have a look at it and uh, we'll make our mind up at the end of this uh, kind of a first look, I suppose. So we've uh, started a brand new game and it says, Hello, welcome to House Flipper. This game will allow you to buy, renovate, decorate and sell houses. For now, however, you need to be content with this shack that you can call your office and the laptop that is your command center. All right, so here we are. So we can't get in because there's a a load of rubbish blocking our way or trash. So we'll uh, we'll press R T to uh, dispose of all of this. There we go. Let's get rid of that one as well. Now we can get through the front door. So let's. Oh my lord! Looks like my daughter's bedroom. So let's get rid of all of that. Um, what but what am I supposed to do with that? Oh, am I supposed to pick all this up then? I take it. Hold to pick up. What? 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 Just what we're supposed to do with this? It's a plate. I have bad experiences with plates. Uh, from cooking simulator. Just pop it back there. Just leave it. Just leave it. No, don't crouch. Don't crouch. What am I supposed to do with this plate? What's what's I, I don't want this plate. Just let go of the plate. RT to. Pop it there. Put just get rid of it. Just I don't want it. I'm, oh my lord, I'm stuck with a plate. Pop it on the floor. There we go. Leave it there. Right, we've got our computer. Here we go. Your laptop. The laptop will allow you to find jobs, buy houses, and switch between them. You cannot afford to buy a house yet, but it looks like you already have your first email. Alright, so we'll press A to use. Uh, we've got some mail. Sarah Lewis, ex-boyfriend, stole the radiator from my house. Hello, I'd like to hire your company to put my house in order. I know from photos posted on Face Spam that my ex-boyfriend broke into my house, made a huge mess and stole the radiator. It is possible that some other things are missing too. Please clean up the house and replace the missing appliances. I would ask you not to inform the police about this whole matter. I will settle it myself with my ex-boyfriend after returning from a business trip. Regards, Sarah Lewis. Right, so we'll uh, we'll accept that then. So, off we go. Oh my lord! I thought that was Sarah Lewis's house then for a minute, but it's just a loading screen. But good lord, have we got to sort all that out? That's a right mess. Who lives like that? Here we go. Congratulations, you unlocked a new tool. From now on, you'll be able to clean dirty stuff using the mop so this looks like it's uh, sarah lewis's house so uh, let's go and see what oh yeah i was right that loading screen was sarah lewis's house good lord right so let's get rid of all this uh garbage on the floor what can we get rid of that box let's dispose of that and uh, all this trash over here all that so they need to go there let's dispose of them and that and that there oh god this is disgusting you vile dirty pigs she's blaming this on her ex-boyfriend she's gone on a business trip and just left at this place in an absolute pigsty hasn't she that's what she's done and blaming the ex-boyfriend and that's why she doesn't want us to ring the police I mean, good lord, woman. You live like an absolute trog. You wonder what a trog is. It's, it's it's another name for a slob. I call it my daughter all the time because she would live like this. 17 years old and doesn't got a care in the world. I mean, look at the state of that mattress. What have you been doing in it, girl? I'm not going to ask, if I'm honest. Right, so, uh, LT, hold. Uh, so, here we go. Cleaning. Right, so let's do some uh, cleaning up in. Cleaner upping. Can we... Uh, look at that. We can mop the bed for her. Isn't that handy? Can we mop that... Uh, 
There we go. I've mopped your mirror for you, love. So I think we're all good to go in there. So let's mop all this up for you. Because uh, that's a bit of a mess as well. Don't worry. I will mop your tables as well. Because that's how we do things here. At uh, CGD House Renovations. Mop your walls as well. Get all that bean juice off the walls. You need a splashback panel, if I'm completely honest there with you, love. I can install you on at a cost. Right, let's uh, do this bit as well. There we go. Clean your doormat. There we go. You are improving. Turn on the tablet to choose what you want to spend the new skill point on. Right, so how do I open the tablet? I think I press this button. Here's my tablet. Uh, so skill points, that's what I want. So does that come under perks? Yes, right. Penetrating vision. See some dirt on the minimap. Uh, fast hands, 25% faster cleaning. Or upgrade the mop. Let's upgrade our mop. So we've got a good mop now. Look at that, see? Right, so let's get mopping with our mop that actually looks like a brush or a broom. Look at this now. We're flying through this cleaning process. Right, we'll come back and get that box shortly. I think we've got that. Let's clean... A dirty, rotten, disgusting sofa. I think the bathroom is the next port of call in this uh, terrible process. I'm actually enjoying this. This is actually quite fun. It's just another one of those games that I can see being quite addicting. Now, there we go. Right, so I think that's that done. So we press LT again and we just go with the old hands because we do have a cardboard box over there. Uh that needs getting rid of. Right, we need to pick this up. All to pick up. Pop that on there like so. There we go. So we'll place that there and we need to pick this chair up. Uh, pop that there like so. No, put it, put it back. Put it there. There. No, just there. Excellent. Right, pick that one up. How do we rotate it? There we go. No, nope, rotate it that way. Tuck it in. It was nice and neat. No. Nope. I mean, how's she supposed to... There. Leave it there. Excellent. Right, so let's... Can you close that cupboard door, fella? Open. Close. It won't shut properly. Why won't it shut properly? Ah, oh, well, we'll leave it as it is. Right, it seems that you've got a bit of a radiator missing now. Uh, from now on, you have a tablet at your disposal. Press that button to use or hide it. It allows you to buy things. It'll be handy for this task. Right, so let's open up the tablet. Um, store, there we go. Right. So we need... Uh, will it come under walls? Or will it be installations? Let's have a look at installations. This doesn't look good, does it? Heating. That's what we want. So there we are. That radiator looks like it will fit here. So we'll buy that. But £22,000 in the bank. Good Lord, I'm rich. Right, so that's going to want to go there. So uh, how do we install it? Just assemble. Ooh, I like this. What do we do here then? There we go, pop that in there. And then we're going to want to tighten that up. Tighten that up. Oh, yes, this is like uh, it's like a mix between power wash simulator and uh, car mechanic simulator in a, in a roundabout kind of way. There we are, and then uh, we'll sort that out. So that's the radiator on. Clean dirt, 98%. There's 2% dirt somewhere, ladies and gentlemen. Let's just close this door. Where's this dirt, then? Is there a way we can see the dirt? Is there something that we can press um, to see any... I mean, what's... Is, is that supposed to be there? Open. Close. Let's pick that up. Let's put this in an appropriate place. What about... Turn it round, Lee. There we go. No, spin it that way. There we go. Why is it going into the wall? No, don't put it in the wall. There we go. Pop it there. There we go. Can we close the door now? 
Oh, yes. Right. Let's just uh, see if we can find this remaining dirt. Let's just give the bath a bit of a scrub. All that. Can we open the toilet? Does the toilet need a clean? Is it that mirror? We don't seem to have found it yet. Is it the windows? Let's get some air in here. There we go. Why is this bloody dirt that she's... Uh... I can't see any more dirt knocking about, can you guys? I reckon we should just complete the job and uh, make like a shepherd and get out of here. You've completed 99% of the job. You may now complete the job for £573.09. pence. The job is not fully completed. Are you sure? No. Let's just have another mooch about. Is it at the back of the sofa? Must be somewhere where there's a little bit of dirt. There we go. Let's just have a, a mooch around like this. Like so. Uh, let's just go back to hands. Can we open the toilet up? No. Okay. So let's give this a good scrub over there. Give the bath and all this a good scrub. Let's look a bit dirty there, I think. There we go. Got to be clean now, surely. Looking great, my end. Looks good for me. Well, Sarah Lewis must be chuffed to buggery with the job that I've done. Right, it's getting completed. I'm not messing around anymore. Well, that's our place, which remember, that is a loading screen. We have tidied our place up a little bit. Come on, load up, for crying out loud. Let's have another look at our place. Let's have a bit of a tidy up here. Sort some of this out. Let's get rid of all that rubbish. In fact, we could actually... There we are, we can get a mop out in our house now. And start having a bit of a clean up of our gaff, because it's a bit of a dump. Let's... Uh, mop the cooker because that's how we do things like i said let's give that a scrub up there and the windows a scrub about that up there does that need cleaning what's in here oh my lord look at this did anybody has anybody actually ever lived here before because it's it's disgusting look at this I don't think mopping the mirror is going to really help things. We've got a few things missing in our gaff, if I'm completely honest. There we go. Let's get rid of some of this. Uh, we're going to need to switch to our hands. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. We don't want to pick them tools up. Anything in here? No. And we'll get our mop out because this desk's a bit dirty, in it? There we go. Can't work around all this muck. There we go. Place is looking a little better now, apart from the plate on the floor, which I've just mopped clean. What about this wall? Can we mop that? Right, let's see what is on the computer today. What have we got on here now? Oh, we got two emails, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Caroline Smith wants us to clean the garage, and uh, Jack Gra Grahan wants some radiuses. I will pay you. If I am fully satisfied, or you get nothing, winter is coming. The winters are hard, and here are no radiators in my house. Mount them. Well, he gets straight to the point, doesn't he, if we're honest? Let's go see this fella. He wants some radiators fitted. So I think we are the men and women and everyone else in between for the task. I think uh, we can get this done. Right, let's go and have a look. In this happy fella's house. Right, let's go and have a look in this room. You need radiators in here? Yes, you do. Not a problem. Um, I will go onto my tablet. Um, right, so you want some devices mounted, which are radiators. So we'll, uh, we'll buy one of them, and I'll mount that one on there for you now, fella. There you go. So I'm going to pop that on there like so. So let's assemble. So we'll assemble that one on and we'll tighten these up. We've just done one in that young lady's house, haven't we? So we should know what to do here. 
There we go. And we'll attach that one to there. And that one to there. And then give that a good tighten up. Right. That's one radiator done. And we've got a skill point. So let's quickly dive into that. Uh, faster mounting. So let's do that. We can put radiators on the walls a lot quicker. So this one's all right. He's got a radiator there. So that's good to go. What's in this room here? Looks like the lounge. That's got a radiator on. So that's all right. That's the garden. He's not going to want radiators in there. But yeah, it's like a bloody maze, this house. Here we go. Right. Let's open up the tablet again. Uh, go to the store. There's another radiator there, so we'll buy that. Uh, let's pop that on the wall there. There we go. So let's assemble. You've seen me do it once. You're going to see me do it again now with another radiator. There we go. Let's pop that one down. Excellent stuff. And we'll tidy that up as well. There we go. And that's another radiator on. There must be some more radiators that need uh, popping on here. Looks like we've, what's we've got, what have we got here? Is this for a radiator? What's this? Well, that's for a sink. He doesn't want a sink, does he? He didn't say anything about a sink. Um... Well, fella, I don't, I don't know where else you want a radiator fitted because of, there's radiators everywhere now, pal. There's one in the baby's room. Um, you've got one in here in your office. Can I ask a question? Um, elephant in the room. Where do you sleep, sir? Because the baby's got a room. You've got, like, a, an office in here. Then, like, a, a washroom, and then, like, a lounge. Uh, so, I'm just wondering where he sleeps. Are we done, or what, here? I, c I can't understand where he wants another radiator, because he's got radiators already in. So, what does he want me to do? Strange man. Does he want another radiator there, but there's no fittings for it? We've done that one. I'm very confused at this now. I'm just sort of wandering around his house trying to make myself look busy. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Towel radiator mounted here. I didn't see that there. Right. Uh, so let's go. Let's get rid of this one because we don't want that radiator. Um, installations. Heating. Uh, mountable towel radiator. There we go. So I'm going to buy that. There we go, and we're going to uh, stick that on there like so. Assemble. So this is all new, new bits and bobs, so let's screw that in. And uh, pop that on as well. Like that. And we'll screw that one in. All this is missing now is the sound effects of these things being um, fitted like it does on Car Mechanic Simulator. That's all that is missing. Let's screw that one on. We'll screw that one on. And that one on. There we go. Right, so that's that on. Surely he doesn't want me... Uh, is that everything done now? Complete the job. I've completed 75% of this job, so there must be another radiator somewhere that he wants fitted. Where, brother? Where? Surely you don't want a radiator outside. That's just nonsense. You ain't got an outhouse or something like that, have you? Or a garage or something weird. Where do you want this other radiator fitted? I'm just checking that it's not in the hallway somewhere and I've completely missed it. Um, my mind's blown as well, love. Um, well, I'm, I'm not seeing it. Surely there must be some guys now watching this. One of you guys watching saying, it's in that room, CGD, it's in that room. You've walked past it four or five times now. I'm not seeing it. I'm really not seeing it, because that's got a radiator. Have I got to fit the sink? No, I'm surely. What's it say? 
Right, let's have a look at this. Um, let's see if we can buy a sink and see if that finishes the job. Let's go back, back. Uh, walls, will it come under walls? No, it won't be under walls, you dimwit. Why would it be under walls? Let's go back. Flooring, ceiling. Got the installations again, ain't it? Uh, other. Oh, here we go, look. Sink plumbing system. Uh, shower plumbing system. Where's the actual... Uh, let's go into other. No. Heating for assembly. No, where the... Where's sinks? Go back again. Floor is doors, floor and ceiling, glass walls, insulation, ladders and scaffolding, walls, windows. Well, I'm completely lost. Oh, it does say sink. I do have to install a sink. It says it there on the right-hand side, you dimwit. Right, so let's unscrew these. I'm not going to get covered in water, am I? Unscrew that. Take that off. Right. You can buy a sink and mount it here. Right, so let's go to there. So let's search item. Uh, so let's search uh, sink. Uh, mountable sink. That's what we want. There we are. We'll keep it simple and buy a white one. There we are. So let's mount that. Assemble. And that's that in. Uh, push it in there like so. Underneath. Tighten this up. Put the washers down, put that bolt down, washer down, bolt, and again, right, let's get the water all plumbed in, like so, tighten it up, oh, we're doing a grand old job here, guys, there we go, put the uh, taps down, there we go, I'll put that on. All the drainage system. There we go, put that on. A nice trap on there. Pop that in. There we are. Jobs are good, and ladies and gentlemen. And we've got another skill point. So 100% of that job is complete. Whoop, whoop, for CGD. Whoop, whoop. We've done really well there. Quite impressed with ourselves on that little effort. Right, shall we see what other job we have got to do? Right, so uh, let's quickly dive into uh, the handyman section. So I'm going to second. Look, we've got little things up here we can we can check and upgrade on different things. So sh oh, we've got nothing in there. So we've only got. Hang on a second. What's this one here now? One negotiation. So we can get 2% of the job's requirements, open to negotiate the price, 10% extra payment for the job. I reckon. No, I'm not, I'd like to do a full job, so I'm not bothered. There we go. We get 10% extra payment for any job that we do. And then we've got a skill point here to do. 20% faster mounting. So let's upgrade that to 50% faster mounting. Uh, there we go. So we've got some more mail. Cleaning the garage. Amaranth walls, a baby on the way. What's this one? I want my house to look a little bit more arty. Can you please paint some of the walls in the living room? Amaranth, the remaining walls should look stunning in grey. Oh, I almost forgot. Can you please replace the broken electrical socket? Well, this sounds a little bit tricky. Shall we give this a go? Amaranth and grey. Right, so let's go and do this. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if we can screw this up. Let's see how well we do here. So that pink... Oh, good lord. Right then, let's go and see the lounge. It's bloody hell. Where is the lounge? I take it this is it. So paint with the colours Amaranth, Adventure and Grey. Okie dokie. Right, so let's go. Here we go. So we need to go to the store. Can we just click on one of these and it takes us... There we go. 
So I will buy a medium one of those. We'll pop that on the floor there. There we go. And then we'll go here. We'll get our roller out. Load her up with paint. So which wall do they want? Uh, painting. That's the question. Let's do that one where the TV is. There we go. Oh, yes. Does that go all the way? Yes. Look at that. We don't even have to move stuff out of the way. Excellent stuff. We'll have this done in a jiffy. But we need to fill up the paint again. Well, this is going to be a pain in the arse, isn't it? Right, here we go. Let's do the next one. And the next one. Well, yeah, we'll fly through this now. It won't take as long at all. Oh, hang on, hang on. There we go. I think we only need to get the circle around once and it's done. There we go. And another one. Will we get that last bit done? There we go. Right, stood on there. Get off there, will you? Right, uh, let's fill the old uh, roller up again and get the next section done. There we go. Quite the painter and decorator, aren't I? There we go, let's get this one done. And then, oh, no, no, we don't want a second coat. And that one. I should fill the paint roller. And there we go, I think we bought just enough paint as well for this wall. That looks like it needs another coat there. There we go. And one next to it. And one next to that. And that one. No. No. No! Uh, now I'm going to have to repaint that bit again. Bloody hell. There we go. Last bit. Come on. Mark that bit. No. No. We're going too far. That bit. That's it. There we go. Right. That's the feature wall done. So how do I get rid of that? No, hide tool. No, I need some more paint. Well, let's go to here. So we need to buy that one, don't we? There we go. So we'll get a large one of these. Large, 26, 26. We'll bill them for that. There we go. Right, so we'll pop that down on the floor there. Get the old roller out again. Right, what's this? Sell objects. All oh, right, that's cool. Right, here we go. Right, my fingers crossed. We can get this job done nice and efficiently. There we are. Let's get this bit done. The controls could uh, do with a bit of a messing around with, but I ain't gonna bore you guys with that while I dive into the uh, controller settings. I don't want to be doing any editing on this video at all tonight. So uh, we'll keep it as it is for the time being. There we go. Let's get that section done. And that section done. We'll have this done in a jiffy. Another skill point as well, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go and check that out because that could be um, something to do with painting, which will help us efficiently uh, do this. Well, there we go. You see, we can paint more, paint two walls at the same time. You won't waste paint on an already painted wall. Oh, what do I pick? 25% faster or paint two walls at the same time. How does that work? Oh, I don't know which one to pick. Does that mean like two, like in a corner, do you think? But how can I paint three walls at the same time? Let's do that one. I'm, in, I'm intrigued to see what the hell that means. There we go. Right. So I'm not painting two walls at this. Ah. Hang on a minute. You know, how much paint did that use? Right, so if I go there. How did I do that last time? I'm confused at what's happening here. Very confused what's happening. Ah, look. Got it now. Figured it out. 
Right, so what I can do now, if I press there and start painting and moving along, it does both at the same time, you see. So, yes, I do like that. So that is cool. We will have this job done in no time now. Look at this. We're flying. They're going to love this when they get home. Everyone's going to be employing CGD to come round and uh, sort the house out. We're going to be one of the... Nope! Oh, one of the most popular DIY doer-uppers. Get his own TV show and everything at this rate. We need more paint again. This is getting on my nerves. We need one of those... Uh, those paint rollers that don't dry out. You know, they just hold the paint for ages. Ran out again. Bloody hell. I think I should have got the 25% faster one. That would have been a lot better, I think. I'm actually enjoying this. Are we going to see more of this on CGD games? Will this make a good live stream? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments. And while you're in the comments, just above the comments section, there's that like button, that thumbs up button. If you wouldn't mind giving that a little tickle for me uh, while you're there, it uh, would be very much appreciated. It really does help this video get out there into the YouTube algorithm and uh, helps people like you find content like this. And uh, they can enjoy the video too. I mean, House Flip is an old game. Everybody's seen this game being played. But they've not seen it being played the CGD way, have they? Not at all, no. So, do not deny uh, the chance for other people to witness this fabulous content here on CGD Games. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button as well. And hit that notification bell. So you know when new content drops onto the channel and when I go live twice a week, every Tuesday and Thursday. I hope you're all enjoying these videos I've left for you to watch while I'm away in Turkey. Um, I think I'm having a nice time. I'm not there yet at the time of recording, but I can only presume I am having a lovely time. Um, I really did want to leave you guys something to watch while I was away. Didn't want to leave you without any content at all that's not what i'm about i like to keep the channel flowing no gaps and uh leave you with some decent simulation content to watch here on youtube uh if you are unaware at the time of recording uh which is in august uh, this is available on game pass for you to download for free or play in the cloud uh my experience on Xbox Cloud isn't the best. Um, it's never really worked well enough for me to sit and play a game uh, for any length of time at all. Um, not like some other cloud gaming uh, platforms that I've used in the past. Um, not great at all, so I would recommend downloading. What I use uh, xCloud for more than anything is if i am interested in a game i'll load it up in the cloud and just try try it for 10 minutes and if i do like the feel of it and i like the look of it i'll uh, i'll download it in full then onto my xbox so that's what i use it for mostly it is good for that there's nothing worse is than sitting there downloading a game over your internet takes about half an hour 40 minutes especially if it's a big game like gta or something like that and uh, you just don't enjoy it it's not for you it's not your cup of tea no don't paint don't paint the ceiling good lord let's do that section there there we go right let's get a little bit more paint fingers crossed we've got enough paint here to finish the job it is looking we've got to do this section down here there we go Let's fill it up again. I don't think we are going to have enough. It is going to be close. We've got another window to do as well. They're the, they're the pain in the arse sections. The windows, they're, they're a damn nuisance. We need to get a little bit closer. There we go. And that one as well. Uh, excellent stuff. Uh, a little bit more paint. 
think we may have to buy a small tin of paint, I think, just to get this job completed. Last one. Oh, no. Let's get some more paint on the job. Can, could she not have just uh, had this wallpapered? It would have been a hell of a lot easier, I think, in my opinion. Right, so we are going to need some more paint, which is a bloody pain in the ass. Uh, so I'm only going to buy a small. I don't want any left over now, do we? Let's buy that. There we go. Right, pop that down there, Lee. Right, how do we uh, get shut of stuff? How do we get rid of this? Um, well, I don't want to rotate it, do I? Where's my... Right, yeah, I want my paintbrush out. That one. Right, excellent. I don't know how you get rid of stuff. Hold and switch to dispose. Hang on a minute. How do we get rid of that? Well, how do we get rid of it? Ah, right. Let's get rid of that. No, no, don't hold it. Put it down. Put it down. You don't need to hold it. Press LT. No, right, let's just, just get the paintbrush out. Let's just finish the bloody job, for Christ's sake. And don't knock that paint over. Right. There we go. Let's just get this job done and let's get out of here. I want to finish on time today. Um, I've got a busy afternoon at home. Oh, I, I don't think I'm going to have enough paint. I'm going to have to buy another one, aren't I? I can see it already. There we go. Let's get that bit done, which we painted incorrectly before. Do you know what? I think we might just have enough here. Fingers crossed. Right, let's get behind this radiator done. Always the tricky bit. There we go. And that one. And that one. Fingers crossed we painted the right wall pink. That's my uh, thinking. But if it was me, that's the feature wall. That's where everyone's looking at the TV. So they're going to want that pink, aren't they? I mean, it's not my choice of colour. Not something uh, I'd go for. A bit garish, if you ask me. And we've got a new painting skill as well. Let's quickly dive in and have a look at that. We'll get some instant painting. 25% faster. There we go. So it should now be a little bit easier to finish this job off. Look at that already. On that one. Oh, yes. Now we're talking. On that one. On that one. And there, and then we've just got to go across the top with our last little bit of paint that's in that pot, I think. Oh, don't tell me I've ran out for this last bit. Come on. Ah, oh, you... See if we can get a little bit more out of this. I should refill the paint roller. Bloody hell, I've got to buy more paint. Okay, do we get to keep the paint? That's the thing. Because I'm going to buy like eight quid's worth of paint here. And I don't really need it. So do I get to take it with me and use it on another job? That's the question. There we go. Right. Why can't we paint across? Why do we Why do we go upwards? You should, in this situation, I should be able to paint across. And just do it in one fell swoop. Right, are we done? Oh, no. Oh, you're kidding me. That one little bit. 91% done. What? There we are. That's done. What for missed? Seriously? What have I missed? Everything's done. The whole room is painted. <gasps> oh, no. Look. Missed that bit. Fingers crossed this fills it up. It's a good job we bought that extra bit of paint, isn't it? Let's get a little bit more. 95% now. Let's uh, get the rest of this done. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. 97%. 98. 99. And we are done. And you wanted an electrical outlet as well, didn't you? Where do you want that popping? 
anywhere. You're not fussed where you have your electrical outlet. So let's go to store. How do we get out of this paint section? Uh, back. So if we go to tasks. Uh, repair, repair one electrical outlet. So where is this electrical outlet? Put that bloody paintbrush away, for Christ's sake. Walking around with it willy-nilly. Right, where's this electrical outlet you want fixing? Have I got to go looking for it, have I? Is that it down there? Is this what's buggered? How do I know if it's buggered or not? Shift this bloody plant, will you? Can't see wood for trees. Move this plant. Pop it there. We'll put it back in a minute. Is this the one that's broke? How do you crouch? How do you know something's broken? Let's just go and have a look around the house and see if there's anything that's blatantly obvious that needs repairing. Nothing in there. Kids' bedroom. Everything seems to be hunky-dory in there. Hmm. Are they the only rooms? Obviously, a child lives here on his own because this is the only bedroom. There's an electrical outlet down there. Ah, that one's looking a little bit shocking, isn't it? Yes, it's this one. Right, so let's sort this one out. Um, and Let's get rid of that. There we go. And uh, let's get rid of all of this. There we go. Oh no, I don't want to be pissing around with all of that. Right, so, let's go in here. Yeah, children's room. Um, it did say there, so. Store. So, is it installations? No, so it's not one of them that you need, is it? Is it one of them? Is that what we've just took out? I'm going to buy one of them. Okay. Let's pop that on. There we go. Zoom in. Assemble. Have well, I just got an electrical shock? Yeah. Right. How do I turn the power off? Where's your fuse box? Because I keep getting electrical shocked in there. I, I, I mean, I'm going to have to win this video pretty soon, so you need to let me know where the bloody fuse box is. Because it's like 11 o'clock on a Sunday evening here, and I, and I want to go to bed. So where's the... Where's the fuse box? It's not outside. I've got all the way around your house now. This, this just isn't funny anymore. You need to let me know where your fuse box is, because... I'm not playing games anymore. Is it in here? There's paint everywhere. Smells lovely, though. Right, well, I, I don't know. I, I'm confused. Right, do you know what? No, I don't want to return to the office. I want to repair this. What I want to do... Assemble. Right. I press that. There we go. Screw that down. Like so. And now that one. Yep. Pop that in there. That one. Pop that in. There we go. Uh, so now what do we do? Screw that in. And screw that in. And that in there. Screw it in. Jobs complete. Click the right stick. You have completed 75% of the job. You may now complete the job for 682. The job is not fully completed. No, so what for not done? Complete room, 70 meters squared. 
I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Don't, well, do you know what? Sack it. We're done. <laughs> right, ladies and gentlemen, I think we will leave it there for today. Doesn't really explain itself there what I was supposed to do unless I was completely missing something. If I was missing something, please do let me know down in the comments. But thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you have enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, maybe consider hitting that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you know when I go live and new content drops onto the channel. But once again, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all on the next one. Goodbye.